I mean, if you were going to do it all over again, is there anything you would have changed about how you got into taxidermy or, or advice if someone is listening to this and just like, man, I'd love to, you know, build a shop. I'd love to have that, that lifestyle. I love deer and, you know, getting all the, the antlers that come in in the fall. How, what would, what advice would you give them looking back at your own journey? And it's funny you asked that because I've, I had a, uh, senior in high school job shadowed me probably in January or February. He wanted to be a taxidermist and he's now at school too. And so we're, you know, texting pictures back and forth and whatnot. He's asked me for advice, you know, what would you do and whatnot? Cause he, I think he just graduated like last Friday or something. Oh wow! And I was like, you know, get your name out. That's the biggest thing for a taxidermist is like, you just got to, advertise 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 